What's up guys, Lego Boy here today, and today I've got one of my custom minifigures. Um, this is the first out of the Civil War minifigures that I'm making uh, for uh, the Civil War line. And uh, yeah, so this is Ant-Man, and uh, what this really makes it a Civil War figure. One, it inspired me to make it, and uh, two, because this is just Scott Lang from the film, because he's just wearing kind of shabby clothes in the back of the van. Uh, on the scene and uh yeah so that's kind of Scott Lang he's then all of this is official Lego figures uh pieces I mean the head is official Lego it's Ezra's head uh but Lego gave him that head which was good but it needed a beard so I just added on the beard uh kind of stubble there and then didn't really do it from the back because um uh, didn't really want to so, uh, yeah, let's look at the uh, Ant-Man display case. Uh, first of all, it has uh, the Ant-Man logo here uh, on the top. Uh, just, I got that at uh, just like a garage sale where they were selling these little tiles and Accessories for 10 pence each and this is a custom one so I went ahead and got it and uh, Yeah, so this is a little display case Looks really cool. You can just take it out like that or access it from the back I'm just gonna leave it like that And uh, yeah, so I've really done to make it a Civil War uh, Custom minifigure. I filled in the gap um, and weathered it so yeah, let me take this clear head off for displaying purposes and move Scott Lang's body to the side and put this on. So that looks really cool with his eye showing through. And as you can see, there's a tiny bit of weathering through the crack there on the side and uh, over here, weathering there on the top. And then up on here and uh, here as well and uh yeah so it's weathering uh, of, whoa, quite a bit everywhere uh, so uh, yeah original uh, legs torso and just a new helmet so as you can see I did fill it in with uh, the white uh, putty so there's uh, I'll pull a picture up now uh, possibly and uh, so you could see how it looked without uh, with the white party in before it got painted and uh, yeah it looked it looked okay before with just normal grey it looked a tiny bit lighter but for weathering uh, I just got a little tiny bit of black wiped it off and uh, just basically got another bit of grey and started painting on there it looks a lot better in my opinion and uh yeah so this ant-man figure is really cool lego done an amazing job at it at first it's just that all the customizers uh you know everyone literally i don't think some of the kids would mind but just the mouth guard uh wasn't very good and now the ant-man set sells for around 50 pounds uk um on ebay and bricklink and uh yeah so it's got a bit of a hefty price i didn't want to sell my set so i've got so i still got anthony here <laughs> as you can see it's covered a bit of dust on him but if we um if we can put ant-man on it and he will look really cool As you can see, that's a really cool um, pose. And uh, yeah, so I'd like to thank you guys for watching this video. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. This was Lego Boy uh, signing out. And just to be clear, there are going to be 
uh, two ones pretty soon, two more customer reviews. Black Widow and a, uh, 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 sorry, um, a uh, Black Panther. But I uh, didn't really want to show you that for too long, so uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching, this was Lego Boy, out. Oh.